Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So I have finally uh, have enough footage to actually uh, you know show you clips of my beauty e eating everything that uh, I offer to him. Uh, this video is mainly to show everything that I that I feed my my beauty, and you know not just weekly but basically um, for an entire year. I also don't want this video to be uh, half an hour long, so you know the routine, uh, the basically monthly routine that I have for him. You know, I will leave that for next week. In this video, what I want to do is uh, basically uh, show you exactly uh, what I feed my beauty, and also give you, uh, you know, a couple more, a couple more options. Uh, you know, just in case uh, you want to, uh, you want to feed something else to your beauty. You know, aside from just crickets and romaine lettuce. So you know, a bearded dragon diet is actually not complicated. The problem is that actually most people, you know, especially new people, uh, new keepers, they don't know about it. Now, you know, this is obvious because, uh, you know, they usually don't do the research or uh, they don't know that uh, they can actually do research on this. The bugs and, uh, and vegetables and, you know, other stuff that uh, you can give to a beardy, uh, they basically fall into, uh, you know, three categories. You know, one is basically the, uh, the staple the staple feeders, also what I call the uh, the rotational feeders or veggies, and you know the uh, something that is just like a treat, something that uh, you can give like once a month or even once a year. Also, one thing that uh, you should know is that uh, you know uh, bearded dragons when they are young, uh, they should eat about you know 70 to 80 percent of uh, of bugs and then you know the rest of vegetables. Don't joke, Mister. And you know from from about a year old. To uh, you know, to the rest of their life, they should be. It should be like about the opposite. They should be eating about 80% vegetables, and you know the rest of bugs. And that is a mistake that uh, you know most of us do, especially you know when uh, when we are new to reptiles. So you know this is why here in this video, I'm just going to show you the options that uh, you could have, and you know I'm just going to uh, to share everything that I feed to my bearded dragon. So you know what uh, this either young or adults they can eat all of this <laughs> All right, so you know uh, here. I'm gonna start with the staple, you know veggies or bugs So this is something that you can feed more often You know, uh, one video that I wish I had was uh, of my beardy eating grasshoppers. You know, uh, when I got grasshoppers, uh, he was roommating, so this is why I don't have video of it. But that is also an option that, uh, you know, grasshoppers are really good for, for your lizards. So, you know, they are considered a staple, staple feeder, not staple.
Ha, <laughs> And you know, uh, last but not least is the tricks. Yay! <laughs> Good job, Amun.
a couple more options that I you can give to your to your beauty. And you know, I'm not going to show a video of this. Is uh, you can actually give them uh, pinky mice and also feeder lizards. Well, obviously, this is something that you don't have to feed. You know, uh, as long as you offer you know enough uh, protein, you know, which is bugs, and you know, like I said. Adult beauties, they will need more vegetables, so you know, this is not something that they need. It's something that you just can give as a treat. And like I said, you know, it's something that I give once a year. You know, I also want to say that there's a, a ton of options that you can feed, uh, you know, to your beauty. Now, obviously, I never recommend feeding them anything that you actually don't know that is good for them. So, you know, if you want to try something other than what I'm telling you, you know, just make sure that uh, you know for sure that it's safe for your beauty. All right, guys. Well, you know, that's going to be all for us. <laughs> and, uh, you know, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that uh, you guys enjoyed this video. I will have uh, more um, information in the video description, so you know, make sure to uh, go ahead and read that. Especially, you know, if you want to know uh, where you can get grasshopper from here in the U.S. So, you know, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and please don't forget to turn off those notifications. And I'll see you next week.